Hey, hey chumps and chumpettes, welcome back to the hollows. It is freaking freezing out here. Look at it, I'm all rugged up. It's that cold. Oh, just, just went in there to get a nice warm drink. Oh, it's flipping cold. How are you doing, horses? Oh, that good, huh? Okay. Alright, so the agenda for today, assuming I was hoping it was like, it's a nice sky. Is that it's still freezing? I was hoping that there was gonna be no frost on the ground, no snow, no none of that BS. So we could get to harvesting. Ah, uh, we need to get our oats, we need to get our wheat. Uh, we need to get rid of this stump. Bye bye stump. Um, yeah, we need. We have a lot of work to do still over at the breeding area there, the chicken farm, as it is now. Uh, see what I mean? Yes. Yes, we could mow. I mean, we've done that already. I, it's boring. What we can do is take our lime and put it in the coconut. Sounds about right. Uh, no, we can take our lime and find out where we're going to sell it. And recoup some money. Uh, lime, lime, lime. Not selling it at the lime production, that's for sure. Chicken, ex the chicken place, the new chicken place in town. They wouldn't lie. Yeah, there you go. What do you know? Yeah. Grocery store is probably closest. Yeah. Let's take it up to the chicken place. If it ever fills up, that is. We should have kept a hold of that trailer. Oh, big news. The, um... K-Dub that we borrowed from the mining adventure? Ah, he's gonna let us take it. What a guy. For a cheap price that will work out eventually, but yeah, they've just used it to ship the trailer back. And yeah, we get the truck. Okay, now it's full. We get to keep a truck. Alright, so looking at this map, it's you. Head up past the store. Right, yes. Okay, so as you can see, not much has actually happened. We've not really done a heap of stuff. Just because. Don't hit my new sign. Thank you. Um, just because it's just been too bloody cold. Too bloody cold to do anything. I mean. I can stay on the road here, that would be even more fantastic. Don't take out my neighbor's little box again. We've had to repair that, replace that three or four times now. Okay. Probably should throw on some buckles. Err, yeah, so it's been way too cold and way too wet and miserable to really do much. On the main farm, uh, we, ooh, we we have been doing a little bit of work, not a lot of work, down at the chicken farm there. Uh, just again, getting stuff prepped and ready. We don't actually have any chickens. Oh, come on now, man. Let's just go around him. Uh, yeah, we, we're going to have to buy some egg, some fertile eggs to get cracking with this so I don't want to I don't really want to do that just yet until we've got the, everything else that is required we're not gonna make that turn we're not gonna make that turn no let's just do this excuse me people sorry people There we go. Good as new. Ugh. I think the brakes might need a little bit of work in this. 
Uh, yeah, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, so I want to hold off, I think, starting all that until we've got everything. I don't really want to buy. I want to buy. I mean, we could buy some straw, but we're about to have a fair amount of that. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Why? Why would you stop? Hey! Why, why, what is your problem? Why? Why? What? Yay. Doesn't want to get that and acknowledge what happened. Go on. Go on. Go on. It's like there is really no one. Go All that just. Oh my god. Yeah, just take us back to the whole uh, drivers of this area are insane. I mean, so there's that are that insane around here that I am seriously considering just backing up and moving, selling everything, just just get out of here. Like, uh, I do like it though. But All right, so here we are. A chicken express? I don't know what a chicken joint needs with lime, but whatever, I guess. Uh, yeah. What are we gonna get there? 50,000. That's not too shabby. Alright, so now that that's done. I'm not entirely sure. What else we're gonna do today? Um. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm just gonna head back to the farm and just check on the sheep, check on the horses again, make sure they're okay in this weather, and just probably, probably rest up. So the weather is better and then, I mean we could potentially just harvest it now we don't really need the yield of the oats we want the straw from the oats the, the oats is just it is just only for the horses so um, and that that is taking a lot longer than I expected it to take to raise and make money off horses let's just say that It's, you know what, it stops a lot better now that we've gotten an empty trailer. <sighs> I'm gonna have to. You know what, I'm... I'm hmm. No, no, we won't. We won't harvest in this weather because it's cold. Bloody cold. Um, so I will head back to the... We've got some more lime. Oops. We've got 87,000 in the bank. No, I'm just, yeah, I'm just gonna go back, uh, probably just sit in front of the fire and watch some YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, sounds about right. Okay, okay. Uh, so we're back at the farm. Anyway, this. Tick, 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 tick. Now to go look inside. That's good. You know what? Actually, we won't. We won't. We won't. We'll head up to the chicken farm, and you know we may we need some. We need some wood. We are gonna need this harvesting trailer. That is. We'll just leave that. You know, we'll just park that up here for the time being. Lights off. All right. I will get in the car and I will. Good morning to you too. And I will see you up at the chicken farm. Yeah.
Okay, good. Alright, so we're just pulling up here to the... to confirm? I'm not entirely sure how much of this has changed since last time you guys are up here. Uh... So yeah, we now have a silo up here. We're storing our chicken food and everything else, all the straw and everything that we're gonna need. Uh, we've got a little shed up here. The store, the trailer, the log splitter, and I brought the... That's some close pocket. I brought them a little messy up here because... Uh, we're gonna need a, something to all around feed and everything. So there's that. Um, yeah, so still absolutely no... Still got no... No chickens going on in here. So still, everything's still empty, like I said. Yeah, got some lights rolling too. So when it's dark, uh, we put up a fence. I don't know if that was if that's new. Like I said, it's cold. My brain's not working. Uh, I know you've seen this beautiful thing. Um, yeah, I think we are gonna ex have to expand. Like I said, we do have the ability to do whatever we want with this area and we can expand out here anywhere see on the the map there there's a all that gray stuff the dark brown that's that's ours all this tree area is oh I was like we have an immense amount of land out here it's not a not a great deal of Trees is what was. I thought this was a lot lush, more thicker. Uh, yeah. So, wait. What's, what's this? A, a car. Wait. Someone's just dumped a. It's a nice looking car. I mean, for an old. Hmm, I'm gonna have to talk to the local authorities about this. Just see if, um... Yeah, I see if we're allowed to keep that. That might be an interesting, fun little side project. Ow, ow. Truck. Where am I even going? The wrong way, that's why. That might be a little side project. Last little restoration. Project uh, might be fun. All right, so yeah, that's that's what we got going on up here. Not a lot. Like I said, it looks like it's gonna clear up. So I might head into town and speak to the authorities, and then go from there. Okay, I'll see you in a bit. Alright, good morning. So I did, did decide to um, rest up there, just take a little time off. Wait for the weather to get a little bit better, and it's... Seems better to me, I think. Now let's bring the tractor and trailer over. Uh, I did end up speaking to the authorities about the abandoned car and the junk and... Apparently, before we bought that property, yeah, it's been known as a local tipping ground. Like, a lot of people would just go out there and dump stuff because it's a forest area. Who's going to see it, right? No one's going to find it. So, they did explain, like, uh, I can bring up some sort of criminal thing or something. You know, make, like, a complaint or I can deal with it and I can just... Basically, they're saying it's my problem. Keep whatever you want junk whatever you don't want so yeah let's leave that there for the time being um yeah so they've said you know hey that's you do that they i've had someone come out they checked the uh the identification numbers and everything on 
the car just to make sure make sure we are dropping yeah we do want to drop yeah so it's essentially it's out now and it's now we're going to we're gonna harvest this finally get to do a, an actual harvest on our farm So yes, we are going to harvest the oats first and we're going to give that to the horse so the horses have feed. I mean, there's going to be horse feed here for days. I mean, for days. Uh, we want the straw to go up to the chicken farm and then we want to go do the oats and uh, the oats, the wheat and take the wheat up there as well as the straw from that. So I'll just get this done and I will see you when we're done. Alright, here we go. So that's done, we've done the oats and the wheat now, we've, we got 42,000 liters of oats off that field and haven't done exact, I uh, well, haven't done a final check yet of the wheat, but we got that, we've got uh, 32,000 liters here. Of straw that we're gonna take up now to the chickens. Ah, uh, so yeah, we were. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. That was a close one. Anyway, moving on, as I was gonna say. So we were up there harvesting the field, got the harvester out. That's a. What in the world was that? Sorry. My bad. Um, that's a lot of horsepower. Okay, so we were got the harvester out. We started the harvest. Um, as we got over to the wheat field, a neighbor from one of the houses there came out and she was introduced herself. I was like, "Hey, do you, do you need someone to help? Like, I'm happy to help. I used to do that kind of stuff." And yeah, so Betty, her name was Betty, and she came out and did a bit of a give us a hand. So. She was able to drive the harvester while I picked up the straw from the other field and just ran around. Alright, so let's... Let's attempt to get this straw into the silo here. Dump that in there. This is actually a drive through, so we could. Oh. Yeah. We need to put a little through track. Alright, so I'll, um. I'll empty this off and I'll go back to the farm and grab the wheat. And yeah, we'll go from there. Alright, so we've got the wheat now up here, and you can see we got 22,000 liters of wheat, so about half, about half of what the oats were. 
Which, I mean, it makes sense considering the wheat field was a lot smaller. Let's pop that into there. Well, that's doing that. Let's just jump over to here. Okay, thank you for this. Yeah, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Thank you. Alright, so for roosters, we need eggs, wheat, and straw. Okay, so we got straw and we've got wheat. We just need to go get some eggs. And then for chickens, we need mineral feed, straw. Hmm. Huh. This one's the one that needs wheat. Okay. So I'm going to have to go grab some eggs. Like I said, I've got them lined up. Uh, I've got some fertile eggs from another place to get. Uh, yeah. But I think that's going to do for today. Um, bit of a harvest. Our first harvest here on Hobo's Hollow. Uh, it was fun. We did get to meet another local. Uh, we did slide out in the tractor a lot. Um, yeah. Interesting. We made a bit of money from lime. Which is always good. Making money is always good. But yeah. That's going to do it, and I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.